do kind of physical exercises that have a little bit of balance. They do go to their own GP on a fairly regular basis. She knows if there are additional concerns like behaviors or the center says that he's sleeping too much. She feels it's better to come to the clinic because the knowledge and expertise for persons with disabilities is slightly higher. You at least know what to anticipate. They can't express pain or the intensity of the pain or the location of the pain. They'll just cry. The book helps in many ways. His medical condition, which is written in a tabular form, the doctor who sees him immediately knows, uh, oh, he's got these 10 things. So if we write here that the medicine has to be crushed or it has to be given in a liquid form, then at least the nurses feel like, I know what to do. The behavior component, things that they like or don't like, uh, what will make them calm, what will make them angry. Uh, so those are actually highlighted here. Well, if Sean comes here and he has a meltdown, if you just take him to a separate room, like calm him down, maybe give him some water, take him to the toilet, I think he'll feel so much better.